The image reveal blog landing page is a really cool uh, blog layout. With this one, we spent quite a bit of time uh, getting it to look the way that it looks. Uh, there's a white background for a very specific reason. This gives you the best result. We tried to do this in a dark layout and it just didn't work. So we would recommend if you use this particular layout, stick with the white background and the black text and it will work really well for you. So what can we change on this one? You can change the font. So let's just switch to that. You want to go to the master CSS color changer document and then look for image reveal blog landing page. You can change the month font uh, and that's pretty much what you want to update on this one. So uh, here you would do that. I'm going to leave it for the moment. You know where to grab that. You're going to copy this and then paste it into your custom CSS box uh, page level and then that would give you the result. Um, because this is a, a page layout and that's how we set it up so that you can have a blog index page you're going to add it from load from library at the top which is page level and then switch to add from library and then you're going to pick the image reveal blog landing page and that will then load it as i've just loaded it here hit the update button and then of course you can reload so let's look at these quickly um, there's a footer section and a whole bunch of other stuff that that you can add and edit we're not going to go through those those are self-explanatory let's just open the blog module settings uh, none of the blog posts or categories are ticked over here it means that it displays by default all the blog posts that are there if you have any new blog posts or new categories make sure to come and tick them and then they'll display there for you the rest you can just leave the same uh, there's nothing else to change on the designs here i wouldn't change uh, the colors here just uh, stick with the default and you'll get the best results from this page layout so there we go that's what that looks like uh, and that's how you update this one Thanks for watching.